right guys welcome back to another episode of no man's sky so we're getting towards the tail end uh, we have a couple weeks left and um, I'm pretty happy with the progress that we have accomplished so far um, though I wish I, we got a little bit more stuff done for the quest line but we got quite a bit of it done if we look at the um, log here we just have some base computer stuff planet distress we might even try getting that sorted out um, in the next little while too, we we'll, we might be able to fit that in. Um, can even try working on that today, but we're gonna need uh, the mech in order to do that. And I think I might have already unlocked it, but um, I'll have to check it out. All right, so looking at our garden, we have uh, all our crops grown. We got the gamma weed. The uh, fungus mold, and then we got the solarium and the frost crystal. Just got plenty of that already. Uh, facium and moderate. And then we also got the star bulbs and the cactus flesh. So, got quite a bit of crops uh, from that. Let's just see if we can store some of that. So, we have a thousand of that now. And. Always use the cactus flesh. Actually, used some accidentally yesterday. I think. Uh, where's the other one? Freighter. Gamma weed. Star bulbs. Yep, we could definitely use star bulbs there. Uh, I'm not sure if we have much of that. No, we don't. Frost crystals. Yeah, we need to sell those or turn it into glass or something. I think we actually get more money if we sell the crops themselves, so. Um, we'll do that and then that one so perfect all right so that part's done I'm just gonna sell the remainder and pick up more of those okay we don't have um, much of the uh, navigation data at the moment so I'm not gonna be able to buy that just at the moment but we can come back later and buy some uh, we do have some on our starship I think yeah, we got some. So I'm going to grab 20 of these, put that on here, and then what we can do is we can go and buy some um, distress beacon charts and do that today as well. Uh, if we have time, I'm not sure if we will, but we could always use the parts for sure. So I'm going to use the portal and go to the space station and then we can take it from there. Oh, we still need to do this as well. So I'm going to just go through the log and see what he's basically done.
Alright, so I end up buying a lot of the uh, tech for the, um, what do you call it, the uh, thing here. And we'll be able to uh, upgrade some of the stuff. So we're going to need, let's see here, we've got the ammunition installed. We're going to put this on. So that should be installed now. And then we have the bore. Uh, requires silicone powder. And we got the other parts. And we're going to need two gravitational balls and one solar um, solar mirror. Don't think we actually have a solar mirror. We might be able to buy that. Um, oh, we can actually buy that right here. Alright. And we'll put that on there. And we're going to need another gravitational ball thing. That's why I store some extra additional stuff because I never know when I might need it. So, call it hoarding, call it whatever you want, but <laughs> it comes in handy when you need it, right? Okay, so that part's done, and then we got this. We should have all the parts in there to enable that. We're just going to move this over to here, I think. It's not really going to do much in the charge slot. Uh, for the bullet thing, that might be best to have it in the supercharge slot, though. And I'm not sure if it matters if these things are connected. We still need um, to charge those up. And we need to put that on there, whatever that is. I think it's the dihydrogen. Yeah, dihydrogen. And we're going to need silicone powder. So that can... We should have all that we need. Got that. And silicone powder we should have plenty of. So we can easily charge all that up, and I'll put the rest of the stuff that we don't need back. Put that in here for now. Uh, I don't think we need this either. It's not on us. Alright, so that requires the hydrogen. And this requires the silicone powder. Alright, so that should be all set up. Um, let's see here. This is digging laser. I'm not sure if that's related. No, it doesn't look like it's related to that, honestly. That is related to this, though. So we might move this down here. And maybe that over here. It's not really related to either one of these. I wouldn't mind to get some, um... Oh, yeah, we still have that to do, too, right? We need acid and magnetized ferrite. Great. So I got our Exocraft, oddly enough, upgraded, but I thought I was picking up um, parts for the mech thing, and apparently I didn't have that all set up. So we're going to be using our Exocraft, I think, to do the battle, because I ended up upgrading the weapons and everything like that anyways. So um, 
we should be able to take on those things quite easily uh, with what upgrades we do have. I am in the system. I just need to spawn in our freighter so we can spawn that thing in. And uh, it shouldn't matter too much where we are. It lets us. Maybe too close to the space station. There we go. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I just need to dock here for a quick second and offload some of the stuff that I do have on me. Uh, we got some of these things, some of that I don't really want on us um, while we're doing this. Uh, these we don't really need on us, those are worth a lot. And we'll put those away. Uh, we could use that. Don't really think we'll need the refiner, but no harm in having it. Just stock up on these. And uh, I think we're good to go. I just need to uh, hop down there. And then we'll be able to um, spawn in our exocraft now that our freighter's here. And we'll be able to do that little battle thing and even claim a little settlement but I'm not sure if I want the settlement here to be honest um, I'm just doing it mainly for the quest line okay we got a fleet incoming message but yeah it's the mining um, vessel got damaged again So, yeah, Mining Vessel 1 has, uh, yeah, we'll recall that. I, I haven't been having much luck with getting a level 2 thing. We might need to buy another Mining Vessel, honestly. We'll see if we can't do that tomorrow. So, I just want to see what this planet is. Um, I think I might be too far out now. Or too far in. So let's go ahead and just see what we're looking at for temperature, high temperature planet. So it's probably going to be hot. So again, not ideally what I want for a um, Alright, so I ended up um, taking on that little, uh, what do you call it, that drone attack thing for the base. We got that all sorted out. I built a, 
what do you call it, base, the um, overseer's office or whatever it is. It's somewhere over here. And we have one opportunity for a pumping tower. So we're, I decided that over the cantina, which was uh, not much different. We actually lower production for a little bit if we went with the cantina. It did give 4% citizen happiness, but the approval rating for the pumping tower, which gives more production, uh, was 1% more over the um, cantina. So this is the overseer's office. We get to see everything that goes on in here. Settlement status. Um, until cleared. Um, so this is the debt. Um, basically what happens is when we get out of the red, okay, we're not even getting out of the red, we're going down into debt, um, is we'll basically go ahead and um, start making items, but that will take some time to do. Now I'm going to go ahead and just start production on that one building and we'll hopefully start making a profit now maintenance costs <laughs> yeah maintenance costs is going to be a lot okay so we're, we're going to take a, a while to actually get out of debt i think for this settlement but i'm not too worried about like keeping it because i want to find one near our um our actual base preferably on that particular planet even so we'll see if we can can't build this get the quest line for this one done we'll build our first building and stuff like that and um, if it has any additional quests and stuff like that we can do that but um, I'll, I'll work on the uh, construction uh, making sure I get all the resources and stuff off camera because it does take some time and between intervals we'll have to like restock with different items and stuff it takes a lot of time to do that but outside of that if you are new to my channel don't forget to subscribe comment down below rate the video and i will see you guys next time thanks for watching peace out